Hello folks, my name is Brent Canfield. I'm the CEO of Smart Digital. What we're doing today is we're demonstrating a product that we have uh, at Smart Digital, a product called Sentry Pods. Sentry Pods is a mobile surveillance platform that we designed for rapid deployment and multiple uh, type situations where we need immediate video or access to video without the resources of having cable or uh, the ISP, local ISP for internet connection. So as we unpackage the Sentry Pods, what we're doing right now is we're, we're, we're showing you through uh, a full step process of how we unpackage the Sentry Pods and actually deploy a Sentry Pods and how quickly a Sentry Pods is deployed and yet accessed for immediate access to video. So what you're seeing right now is you're seeing the, the actual, actual Sentry Pods uh, that's, that's used in forward deployments. And this Sentry Pods here uh, is, is just a 12 volt Sentry Pods that we use where it has all Sentry Pods are designed with battery backup and an internal router for in internet connectivity. Um, one of the, the, the greatest features about Sentry Pods is the fact that all Sentry Pods are designed to be agnostic, meaning that we don't need to have any one particular uh, ISP for internet connectivity and we don't need to have these connected to any internal network or WAN environment because each Sentry Pods propagates its own internet connection uh, both for internet connectivity and Wi-Fi accessibility from the ground to make your boots on the ground more exponential. And so right now what I'd like to do is talk a little bit about the acronym Sentry Pods but if you notice I'm literally picking up the Sentry Pods with, with one hand. That's how lightweight these units are. So they're they're designed for rapid deployment and also maximum sustainability uh, with the battery backup. So in the event that we lose primary power, that's okay because Sentry Pods fails over uh, to the internal battery. Pods is an acronym that we, we use for protective over deployable surveillance. And so to, de to, to deploy and install a Sentry Pods just requires very minimal hardware and very minimal tools. But if you look here, you're gonna notice four ears two on the top and two ears on the bottom of the sentry pods these are used for deployment and so for rapid deployment we could either use zip ties or heavy hardware screws or bolts to fasten these to a pole or the side of a building what we're demonstrating right now is we're actually demonstrating the installation of a sentry pods and how quickly the sentry pods goes up and obviously right now we've already got the ladder up but our technician has already got a couple of screws started and he's just going to run the screws into the side of the pole for rapid deployment once he's got the screws in place then our sentry pods is good to go and ready for accessibility so once the sentry pods is secured to the pole now it's just as simple as opening up the sentry pods and flipping the power switch on again no configuration is required. All Sentry Pods are pre-configured before deployment. And so now, once the technician turns the, the power on, you'll notice the camera comes on, the unit comes up online, and is ready for accessibility. So now the technician will come down and we'll get access to the Sentry Pods within three minutes of power up. So right now what we're doing is we're demonstrating opening the Sentry Pods VMS, Sentry Pods Remote VMS software. And so from the point of opening the software, this is how the software opens. Now we're gonna demonstrate quickly how to onboard a Sentry Pods once you get it and unpackage the Sentry Pods out of the box. So you wanna click on the Add button. Then you wanna click OK. And here you wanna use the DNS name that we give you. It's on the configuration sheet inside the packaging of the Sentry Pods. And then quickly you wanna go down and you wanna auto discover the sentry pods and you see here it quickly discovers the sentry pods once it's connected to the internet you click the close button then the OK button and then the OK button and that's it in just a few seconds you'll see your sentry pods populated in the window and you can add up to 64 sentry pods simultaneously to the software and view them from anywhere in the world and connect to them separately so in this case you see a picture of a warehouse here and some pickup trucks. So right now we've just installed the sentry pods and what we're demonstrating right now is showing you that we've got access within three minutes and now we're going to go ahead and control the sentry pods and keep in mind in this situation we have no power so right now we're literally controlling the sentry pods 
from the mobile phone. In closing, Smart Digital is not only integrators, but we're also a security company. And that passion stems from my background in the Marine Corps. I designed sentry pods after the Boston Marathon bombing because of the need for a rapidly deployable surveillance platform. Having redundancy and reliability stacked on the need for immediate access to video. Thank you for watching the video today. If you like, please subscribe to the channel below, CGL Productions.